Hi, my name's Sarah Fudge and I love Hamworthy. And I want to tell you why one of the reasons I love Hamworthy so much and why it's such a great place to live, work and invest and that is behind me. And that is the Moor Community Food Store. We'll go inside and have a look. So, um, in April I started here, I was technically furloughed. Um, but I started hearing that there were people not getting shopping. There were food issues, basically, on Turley Moor. And then, as I started to explore, well, well, how could we, how could we deal with that? How could we support people? I heard that there was five tons of surplus foods coming into pool every week. Um, and my thought was, I want some. I want Turley Moor. So. So that's when um, the wonderful Hamworthy Church and the, and the Vicar there, Tess, um, then said, well, we've got St Gabriel's Church Hall, let's find a way to work, work it. And that's how more community food came into being. It's a partnership with Paul Communities Trust to employ me, a local cha charity who employ me, uh, to work as a community on t worker on Turning Moor. It includes Hamworthy Church, Paul Food Bank, uh, Paul Community Exchange, um, and then our our other partners that we um, uh, that we link with uh, that might be businesses. So, for instance, at the moment we're able to offer because of a donation, uh, milk, eggs. The milk isn't coming yet, but um, just stick it here. It will be over there. Um, milk, eggs, uh, and juice, and that's from Wright's Dairies. We also had a donation for some extra fresh food, uh, the fruit and vegetables, and that comes from Allen Fruit Wholesalers. Um, and then uh, free uh, deliveries, we get a collection from Lidl's at Blandford Road um, uh, on a Monday evening. And uh, starting this week, very excited to report, uh, from Greg's on Nuffield Estate. So we'll be, we'll be having uh, Greg's food as well. So we've got a real partnership. And then, of course, local people who come in. There's a, there's a box of cooking apples there that someone had from their neighbour's garden. So those kind of things are invaluable. And that's what makes the tables that you see beforehand, before you. And you could always do with more, Anne. And we could always do with more, yes. Because, because when you're, you're up to 60 shoppers a week in person, and then 14 deliveries for those who are self-isolating or may not be able to get out of the house for whatever reasons. Yes, this will all be cleared by the end of today. So we're always, always looking for, for more. More food for more community food. This is Mel, one of the volunteers. She's going to give us a few mm. of the details regarding when, where and, and what. Hi. We're here at Moore Community Food every Tuesday from half twelve to half four. Anyone can pop along, you pay a pound membership, that's just a one-off fee, and then if you'd like a bag of food, roughly about ten items plus some of our fresh produce, it's a suggested donation of £2.50. Some people give more, some people give less, depends what you can afford. But we've got some lovely food. And whereabouts are you, Mel? We're at St Gabriel's, Keysworth Road on Turlamore, with the church hall next to the playgroup. Perfect. And, um, you don't need to make an appointment, you just come and line up outside, give your details and come on in. You need to wear a face mask um, and there's gloves if you want them. Perfect. And people can phone and speak to Anne if they want to. I think her telephone number is just that. Yeah. Okay, Anne. Yes. First question, what do you love about Turner Moore in Hamworthy? Um, I, I love working with people down here. I've, um, you know, I've found people have been really welcoming of me. They've been really willing to share ideas and thoughts about how we can work together to improve things for everybody, whether it's older adults, whether it's children and families down here. And they've been ready to embrace, you know, working together in all kinds of different ways, shapes and sizes over the, over the four years I've been here. So that kind of enthusiasm and local community um, 
has been amazing to work with. That's lovely to hear. So what do you at Moore Community Food Store, what do you need most of at the minute? Um, at the minute, uh, well, we, we always welcome donations from anybody. I mean, any kind of food, uh, fresh food, tinned food, anything, anything you find in the cupboard and go, oh, well, we don't need this anymore. Please bring it along. It doesn't matter whether it's one tin or 20 tins. You know, we, we're always, um, yeah, we're always willing to, to find a, a space for it. And of course now, having started in June, we're up to uh, 60 people coming in person to shop and we do another 13 to 14 deliveries. So our, yeah, we're always looking for food and bits. Um, so the other thing that's happening across uh, Turnamore and Hamworthy is that Hamworthy Church and Hamworthy Together, which is broader, is collecting, if anyone wants to donate Christmas type items, that will then go out in, to the community in little bags of support for individuals and families later in the year. So the usual things, kind of mince pies, chocolate bits, chocolate treats, nuts maybe, uh, little gifts, small gifts would be welcome. Um, and the contact for that is Sally Taylor through Hamworthy uh, Together and Hamworthy Church. If you're stuck for an idea of what to buy someone for Christmas, then why not buy a 2021 calendar? Um, these can be picked up from the community food store or contact them via their Facebook page. All the funds go towards the Play More Skate More uh, fundraising efforts. I'm Sarah Fudge, Lewis Dean Estate and Letting Agents for Lewis Dean Locals.